Clean water is perhaps the most precious resource we have on our planet. However, around the world there remain severe risks from exposure to water, which is contaminated with pollutants, poisons and infectious diseases. So what can we do to monitor this and enable authorities to take mitigating action? Well, here in the Ocean Technology and Engineering team at the National Oceanography Centre, we're working towards the use of state-of-the-art methods and technologies to test water quickly, reliably and at a low cost. Our recent work took us to the county of Cornwall, which prides itself on clean beaches, pristine waters and excellent seafood. However, from time to time, the region is impacted by natural phenomenon known as harmful algal blooms. Traditional methods to monitor this would involve collecting and preserving phytoplankton cells and transporting the sample to a laboratory for testing. Then the cells are viewed under a microscope in what amounts to a long and protracted and expensive process. So we have developed a new molecular biology based approach to test for toxic algae within minutes. This method combined with AI technology can be used right on site without the need for a lab or a scientist. This approach is more accurate, significantly faster and potentially far cheaper. The potential for these methods is hugely exciting because genetic analysis can also be directed to other forms of water contamination, including in the detection of waterborne diseases. And so the work continues.